It'll be 20 years to the day soon. The day the sky was ripped apart and countless bolts of light rained down upon us. I think this calls for a little history lesson. In 1994, a group of asteroids was discovered taking a long elliptical orbit around the sun. They were created when an unknown asteroid struck the 1986 VG1 Ulysses, an asteroid in orbit around Jupiter. The orbit of these Ulysses asteroids was on a collision course with Earth with an estimated 10,000 meteors set to strike the surface. Since there was no way to divert the orbit of each asteroid, construction began on a vast anti-air railgun network, a last-ditch effort to intercept and destroy the meteors. They built six facilities. The test unit Type 0 was built in China. Type 1 was built in America, and then four Type 5 units were built in Australia, Turkey, Namibia, and Argentina. In July 1999, the asteroids began to strike. Thanks to the railgun network, damage was kept to a bare minimum. Only about enough to destroy the entire world order. Never in its existence had mankind experienced such a catastrophe. It came to be called the Ulysses Disaster. The near total loss of infrastructure led to economic chaos, particularly in the hard-hit Eurasian continent. To avoid total breakdown, the nations of Asia and Southern Europe rearranged themselves into regional federations. Military budgets were slashed, and the Federation poured most of their money into rebuilding. The depletion of energy sources brought on by the loss of territory soon proved to be a major problem, one that quickly led to an escalation in disputes over natural resources. We'll continue this later. Time to start the briefing. We've got a new guy here today, but I'll have to cut the introduction short. My name's Goodfellow, and I'm your rep from the Arrows. As you know, Arrows is a mercenary force specializing in aerial warfare. Some people like to call us pirates. I prefer they'd call us privateers, at least. We are being employed by the UN Security Council, after all. Anyway, the UNSC's Military Staff Committee just sent Arrows a request for deployment. It was originally going to be an escort mission for the UNF Pacific Fleet stationed in Tokyo Bay, but that's changed. We now have multiple unknown UAVs flying toward Area J4E, Japan's former capital of Tokyo. In other words, right here. The UAVs are likely armed. We need them down before they reach city limits. This will be the first sortie for the rookie here, tack name Reaper. Here's your emblem. Omega from the Bone Arrow flight will be supporting you on this mission. Follow his instructions. I'll be expecting results, you hear? Dismissed. <laughs> 